Hello guys and girls and welcome back to a new video today. This is my reaction video to Bolton Wanderers vs Tramie Rovers at the University of Bolton Wanderers Stadium on the 19th of December. So the score finished, Bolton Wanderers nil, Tramie Rovers 3. Fantastic win for the lads, obviously for me, obviously I am buzzing as ever. And it was a, a fantastic win, the, the lads played absolutely fantastic through the first half and the second half so I'm going to be talking to you about the game and obviously the best bits on the and the least bits so the team I think it was a 4 I think it was a 4-2-3-1 or was it 4-3-3 I'm not too sure on the team but I really can really see I think it was a 4-3-3 Sid Nelson came in the team and took and took over um, Manny Montfield because Manny Montfield wasn't even on the team for this this week's game. And I thought Tramie Rovers played actually decent, really well. And I thought Sid Nelson was good today. And obviously, he, he defended so well in the game. Obviously, clearing the balls out of the way so Bolton can't score. And obviously, with the clean sheet, which was fantastic to see so obviously the first 10 to 15 minutes we weren't as good as we normally are but we came back from that they um bone had a few chances to score they didn't really take their chances trammy overs hit the ball twice and one was offside but it's just one of them days but um 28th minute, Trammy had the corner, cross from Feeney, I think it was, and then great header from uh, Peter Clark to get his fourth goal of the season for Trammy over so far this season. For a defender, it's absolutely fantastic. And to get and to get a goal, which was even better, because it's against Bolton that we all hate. And, uh, yeah, I thought Trammy has played very well in the first half. I thought Sid Nelson was good. I thought... Um, Young was good, who is our midfielder from Newcastle on loan. I thought he was probably the best player on the pitch today. Well, definitely in the first half. I thought Sid Nelson was good in the second half. I thought the whole team was good. So, um, talking about now when Bolton had a few chances, they didn't really take their chances. But in the second half, as we're going to talk in the second half now, Bolton had a few chances to try and get back on level, but they didn't. Um, Scott didn't really have much to do today, which is a good thing, obviously, because Tremio's got a clean sheet. Um, but yeah, I thought the team played very well throughout the game. Um, and then I think it was in the 50, 56th minute or 58th minute, um, Tremio's was soon a lot for goal from Kieran Morris. A good strike from him. Obviously, the keeper didn't know what he was doing because he just stood there like he was on, waiting for a bus or going on a holiday. And then, yeah, it was a great strike. And I was like thinking, are we tuning up against Bolton? And I was like, I was so made up for what happened. And then it, it, I was literally off my head when that happened. And I thought we played absolutely fantastic. We played as a team today. And I thought... All the players deserve the credit. And obviously, um, Keith Hill, he, he gets a big mention for me. I thought his tactics worked very well today. Obviously, Bolton really, they didn't play well today, Bolton. But yeah, we made sure that didn't happen. They didn't score. And we absolutely defended as a team. And I thought Vaughan, Coming, coming back, and I thought he was class today. Obviously, and then yeah, and then um, near the end, about I think it was about twenty minutes near the end. Um, Chami on the ball across from Morgan Ferry. Morgan Ferry came on for um, Corey Blackett Taylor. I thought Blackett Taylor was good first half as well. Obviously, creating chances, but in the second half, I thought. I think, I think everything was going well. Then when Ferry crossed the ball, 
uh, one of their players handball that I think it was Alex Baptiste that got um, done the handball. Personally, I thought it was definitely a handball because it was it was in the box and obviously obviously people were like saying it was it wasn't handball, but it was a handball if you could see it from if you were watching the game. But when we got the penalty, I, I was buzzing. I was like thinking. Personally, I was thinking Banks would take it, but he didn't. But Vaughan took it. He got his ninth goal of the season, which is fantastic. And I thought Tommy Rose could have scored more and more, possibly five, five or six. But I'm really happy with today's performance. Obviously, it goes out for the team. I thought the team were absolute superb. And obviously, defended well. And we didn't let them have many chances. So obviously, Keith Hill, what a, what a guy. Obviously, he was at Bolton last season. And Bolton beat us 2-0 last season. And that unfortunately, that sent us down pretty much because we, I think we only needed another three points to stay up. But yeah, um, Keith Hill... Is now our manager. Happy with the win. Happy with the performance. So yeah. We go on to. Boxing day now. Which we play. Um, Bradford. Bradford at home. It's going to be a tricky game. I think we can win the game. But yeah. I will be doing my preview for that game on Thursday. So yeah. Hopefully you guys like this video, especially I did, especially Tommy Rose fans will, but obviously not not so many Bolton fans would, because I don't think personally I didn't think Bolton played well today, and they didn't really get the chance to. They had the chances to score, but they just didn't take them. So thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe if you're new. So for next time, I will see you guys in a bit. I will see you guys on Thursday. So let's hope we can get more subscribers, more comments and everything going. So yeah, let's do it. Merry Christmas to everyone. Hope you have a good one. I'll see you guys on Thursday. So up the lights. Come on, you boys. Let's try and go up this season. Come on.